Damn jam, this shit a vibe. <laughs> Hey guys, in this video, I'll be sure you guys how you guys can download the skill tree system video. So the first thing you want to do is join my Discord from the link down below in my description. And now you have to go to the video download section. And when you go to the video download section, it's gonna be in this. So it's gonna be in. Uh, it's gonna be updated in the video download section. But you'll see inside of the video download section. Hit the download button, and you'll be able to have full access to the system. Hey guys, I'm gonna be showing sure you guys how you guys can add your own skills to your skill tree and make more attributes to the skill tree so let's go down to the skill tree i put a skill tree all the way down here so what we have to the skill tree uh we have our little generic skill tree we have our uh increased stats so just to give you guys a basis of how this works before you know how to add it so we have this table where it has all of our parts and you see how the parts have right six we have right five four three two one the most important thing to know is when you're adding something into the skill parts you should know the first the first uh index of the name should be uppercase the last one should be the number of which it is in which it is associated with the tree so for example we have one here this is going to be left one two three let me put that back three and four and if i was to add another one what i would do is i would do control d and i would want to essentially use the move key move it up and then i would want to change the name to left part five it really doesn't matter what the middle is called just make sure that you have uh what the what side it's on so if it's on the left it should be an l in the front if it's on the if it's on if it's the fifth one it should have a five so it should be one two three four five and let's say i want to add like a middle let's say i want to add like a middle to the file like i want to do this as well control this and i control d move this up and then what i can do here is i can do middle part five so now we have another now we have five for our, our skill tree so the now what really comes to the important part of this table is that we add we add it into our sk information module script so this so th so this is basically how we're setting our data up because you see uh, when we um when we abbreviate the term l1 it's saying we want the want to change the left one our left most our l1 inside of our skill tree so we just added m5 so we're going to go all the way down to the m4 and all we're going to do is we're going to add m5 we're going to write equals then we're going to put the build text so you can see from the other ones it has build text values and skill points we can put build text is going to be equal to health and let's do six and then we're going to do value we can make the value so how much health we're going to take we can give them 100 we can add them 100 to the health and we can do skill point amount it's going to be equal to one just like let's do let's do yeah, let's do one so we're going to add one skill point and we're going to just put a little comma on the table as well so we just added m5 and its value so what is going to be the name what is going to be uh the um the value what's going to be a skill point it's going to take to get this and we also add one for the left the leftmost point so all we can do here is we can do l5 equals and then we can do the same thing that we did before so just to make it fast i'm just going to copy this and just put it in here and now i'm going to change it to speed six and we're going to have the value we're going to have the skill points i'm going to say you have to take five to get these and that's basically really it that's all you have to do to really add it into the um to add it into the skill tree but the really most important part is if we go back to sk information we still we have speed and then space we have speed we have speed and we have space we have health space then we have power space if we go back into our our uh, uh player added script we see that we have an instance of we have an instance of stats we have int values and these int values have a certain name called power health and speed and they correlate with the sk information so just know that 
if you want to correlate the stats with the SK information, just make sure you have whatever the billing name is. So like, let's say this name, the bill, whatever the bill text is. So whatever the billboard text is going to be, just have it the same as whatever you want the, uh, the int value to be. So whatever you're saving. So if I want this to be like defense, I will put this as defense. Uh, this will all be defense one, two, three, four, five, going all the way down. And it would have a space between defense. So that's how you, yeah, that's how you will correlate it with the, um, with the stats. And all we're doing here is just like initializing the, we're just, we're just getting like the walk speed that always be, that always be updated with the walk speed with the walk, with the current walk speed value and the jump power. So if we were to run this right now, if we were to play it. Okay. There we go. So we are able to hit menu, hit this. And then all we see here, if we hit on, if we hit this, let's go all the way up. And we see we have this health five. You see how this is different from the other one? We hit this and we actually get it now. And then if we do speed as well, we can add, we can increment speed. And now boom, we have speed five. We didn't have a speed five in the original preview. So that's basically how you guys can add your own. You can add your own. You can add your own little skills into the skill tree and modify it to how you like. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I, I put a lot of work into this video and I really hope that you guys found something new or you learned something from this video and this does benefit you in the way you want it. If you have any questions about how the system works or you're having any error problems, just hit me up on my, on my DMs on my Discord. Ask my helpers. They would love to help you. Hope you guys have an amazing day and peace out.